Hi guys, my name is Srinya Tamna. I'm in sixth grade and I'm in Woodrow Wilson Middle School. So today's topic is how are fossils formed? So we're going to be talking about how fossils are formed. In the next video, we are going to be talking about the different kinds of fossils. But today we're going to be talking about how they are even formed. So pretend, I'll just, we need this land. So pretend we have, uh, what can we have? Pretend we have a little bunny over here. He's, I get, I don't even know how to draw a bunny. It's so funny. Wait, pretend this is a little bunny. Um, the little bunny lived, lived for two years and then the bunny died. Okay. So when the bunny dies, then it gets buried in layers of soil. So the dead bunny is here. And the bunny gets um, buried in layers of soil. And in, as the, in the soil, there are decomposers. By the way, I need to write this. A decomposer is any, any animal which which breaks down plants and animals dead ones not real ones breaks down so the okay wait wait wait, wait. so let's repeat this again a decomposer is any animal which breaks down plants and animals dead ones remember that dead ones not real ones not alive ones even so then the decomposers such as earthworms and fungi start eating the matter and the the whole body starts to break down it, it, when it's broke down it looks like this there's only the skeleton is left i don't even know how to draw stuff because let's draw like this only the skeleton of the organism is left. So I'll just draw that. This, this is the skeleton pretend, okay? Then it gets buried in, min it gets buried with rocks and minerals and all of that stuff. So pretend it gets buried with a lot of rocks and minerals. So pretend these are all rocks and minerals. And pretend our little skull is over here. So pretend this is a fossil skull, and then it's not a fossil yet. You you may think that a fossil will be formed in three days. No, it's not that the animal dies after one day of turning into fossil. No, no, no. You know, it, this all takes a lot of time. Rocks to form on the fossil, on top of the fossil, burying the fossil. This all takes a lot of time. And it may take more than one plus million years million years to form a fossil so let me so it will take one years one plus million years to form a fossil and like, that means like a lot of water washes and then all of the, the animals remains and then when all the mud hardens it becomes a the, your skull becomes a fossil and all of the animal remains washed away, leaving the fossils, tra leaving the skulls um, prints in the mud, forming the fossil. So that's how fossils are formed. And yeah, I'll ask some quest two questions before ending this video. So, wait, so okay, let's erase this. And then let's add, let's ask some questions. Number one, what is a decomposer? You have five seconds. Okay, okay. Now let's figure out what a decomposer is. A decomposer, a decomposer is any like um, organism such as um, fungi and earthworms they break apart dead animals and plants that like they eat the roots like skin or like remains of the dead animal leaving the skull behind so that's where the decomposer is and the next question is dun 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 how many years does it take for a fossil to form 
Okay, guys. Yeah, you guys, if you get, if you got one plus million years, you are correct. You may think that fossils form in only like three days. No, 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 no. That's not correct. They form in more. They form after more than one plus million years. So it would take ten years. It would take hundred year, million years, depending on the fossil. So, yeah, that's how much time it will take for a fossil to form. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed my video about fossils. Please don't make sure. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell if you want more videos. Bye guys and I'll see you later in my next video.